Good morning, it's the 28th of June and this is day 6 of my trip around Britain on the buses. Actually, I'm not sure if I've mentioned this on the Rain Series episodes yet, but I'm so confident that the bus network is so interlocked that it's possible to get from Highhead to London and that's part of the challenge that I'm doing. That's my route is kind of a six hour one, but it's heading towards London and that. that's where I'm planning to be at the end of the trip. And so far, half of bus has been late. I haven't encountered a cancelled bus and that. Um, just in the next hand at the moment. Uh, these guys were walking from the bus station to the guest house. It's definitely very different from places stayed in Wales. Um, there's more evidence of homelessness here. And also, in the evening, I found um, there's a lot of people hanging around the centre. Especially young people, kind of maybe not making the safest place. Well, it's some parts could walk for comfortable but setting aids and that. So, also, I think certain parts of the town maybe might not be really places to go. But it's where stay in accommodation, that was a nice day. Um, kind of mixed, well, at least some. No, it's not too bad, me walking up there in that. So I'm just going to head to where I want to visit the next time before catching the bus at 10 past 1. I'm just here at the Western Museum and Archives. It's open most days except Tuesday, Sunday, and bank holidays. And 10 to 5, I think. Oh, so there's something about 10 to 4 as well. So um, last Saturday, I'm from Winters, 11 to 4. And that's what it says. So I assume it's 10 to 5 the rest of the time. It's the rest of the Saturday. So let's take a look inside. Okay, just behind me is Swaxham bus station, where I've got my bus in about five minutes, so I'll get back in. Uh, from here, I could have chosen to go to Lost Station. I could double back to myself to Town Blocking to Barmond. Or I could have chosen to go around to Chester, or straight to Crewe. But instead, I decided to go to Woodchurch. I thought it was more interesting, especially in the area that I'm no nothing really about and taking challenge also uh, to make sure when I was playing this that I could get from the church making sure there was a bus connection it wasn't just a dead end right.
No, we're church. Ah, uh, so I'm just going through the shopping center. Here. So I forgot I'm dark. You know? Yep. Uh, I'll check to reach home for six. Um, I know up to most of it is it's judged by the school signs. They were actually had the welch for school. So I'm not sure if which church is in England or Wales. I know I have to cross over, crossing over the board. And check that one out. The data on the phone, Google Maps. Ah, uh, my problem is you're supposed to get me out further beyond. It's actually gone. Yeah, it's the price last last time. Yeah, yeah, sorry. So, but be taking a second route later around here. So, this is where I stay tonight. No, uh, no I have to find well, not just the accommodation. Also, where I want to visit this uh, Hedges Center. So they could ask on the Google Maps. Um, also, this thing about the bus. So I forgot to mention, quick note. Um, I think it's, well, it's just been designed to fit as many people as possible. So seats are close together again now. Also towards the back there was seats of tree. I think it was probably used as a school bus as well. Which should be actually hanging on the stair. I know some coaches in that were lining up to take pupils and that from the school. Taking school. Looks like this is only after two. It takes an hour. So I think school's finished about three. So that's still gone. And that. Um, obviously, the bus is heading back to Rexham. In town. Um, actually, yes, I. This one is note. Um, he's one to know it's around here well. Um, oh, this part compared to big cities is the drivers are more friendly and so passengers can talk to them instead of like do not be stoic. So that's it. Um, so I'll just find the white church treasure set. Okay, I'm here at the Whitchurch Museum and Archives, which is open Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, 11 to 4. Um, also, at the moment, because of building work, I'm uh, supposed to use the rear entrance, which I'm doing. So let's head inside. Okay, just came out of the White Wood Church Hedges Centre. Um, also quite interesting. Um, also, one thing I learned from in the area, there's some famous clockmakers that have clocks uh, exported to all around the world, well, a few places around the world, and most of the railway shop stations. It's Jacobs of Wood Church. Um, also, the 
Eastgate clock in Chester, one of the more famous and probably photographed clocks, was actually made here in the church by that company. Um, now I'm going to head back to the bus station to get the Segway bus. My last time was today. This is kind of a shortened day in the sense of distance tra travelled between two towns and that. Another bus we ticked off my list, the 205. Um, and now I'm just going to head to my accommodation. Basically, I went to kind of two first points in the town. To the, uh, when I came back in, it was kind of just reached along the outside of the bus stations beside Tesco's. Uh, got the outside just beside a pub not on the outside of sh shops so that's it for my travels today at least tomorrow be much bigger day when I get to uh -huh. at least one of the places in the well the second bus I guess goes to crew um, then to Hamilton bus station, Stoke and Trent. This is, this is the place that I'm getting off. I'll double check my list to get exact details on that. So that's it for today. Day 6.